Hey guys, how's it going? So Activision Blizzard is easy money. Well, I have no idea, but uh, you no, know, they are. They have a deal with Microsoft on all cash stock transaction for ninety four dollars. So right now, if if you buy it at these prices, it could go lower. Um, you are looking at. Seventeen, about seventeen dollars or eighteen dollars, uh, gain. Uh, if they got bought out right now, it usually typically a uh, merger takes about six, eighteen months. But uh, we'll see what happens. I mean, I think AMD's uh, merger with Xilinx took a year. Uh, so we'll see. Uh. A lot of people think that the government will allow Activision to merge with Microsoft, but uh, I don't think there's anything wrong with with it. Activision Blizzard's revenue will hardly impact Microsoft. I mean, they're only making roughly two to one point four seven billion dollars a year, uh, and their profits won't even. <laughs> won't even phase out uh, Blizzard and I mean Microsoft and this is really not a monopoly because Activision is so small in the gaming industry there is so many games out there so many developers so many companies making games out there that it hardly uh, hardly does anything uh, for Microsoft for monopoly wise so I don't see anything wrong with the acquisition in my personal opinion uh, this helps Microsoft diversify into the gaming industry and Microsoft does not dominate the game at all uh, they are trying to be a big player in the gaming industry by acquiring companies like Activision Blizzard Minecraft and uh, I think they also acquire developers of Skyrim so they're trying to be a big player in the gaming industry by acquiring a company but right now they're not so with Activision it would definitely definitely help because Activision Blizzard is one of the biggest gaming companies in the industry but uh, you know and then I also right now Activision is doing poorly but once Diablo Immortal gets released. I think they're going to their fortunes are going to turn around because look at that Diablo Immortal come coming to Ch uh, beta coming to China, Japan, and Korea. Ch uh, these three countries alone will rake in a hundred million players, Ch especially China because what's going on in China? There's a pandemic going on in China. China's getting locked down. People got bored. Uh, there's a lot of people who have cell phones. There's a lot of there's a lot of hardcore gamers in China, uh, and I think China will, in uh, will easily get, you know, China, Japan, and Korea will easily get a hundred million, fifty million from China, twenty five from Japan and Korea, so easily a hundred million players from just three countries alone. That is my opinion. We'll see what happens. Anyways, uh, and it's a free game, right? So it doesn't stop anyone from downloading it and playing it. So, you know, I think they're going to do very, very well in these countries. Uh, and I think act, uh, it's, it's going to rake in Activision Blizzard a lot of money. Diablo Immortal. That's my opinion. Anyways, um, the market right now is... Uh, volatile but uh, that's why I say Activision Blizzard is easy money I, I also heard that uh, Warren Buffett put a billion dollars into Activision Blizzard at like 80 bucks so he's already bank holding and yes I do have a position and yes I am bank holding but do plan to buy some more uh, because it is easy money so I don't know. We'll see. I mean, it could go lower. I'm ho if it goes to 35, I'll buy some more. If it goes to 34, I'll buy some more. You know, 
Sorry, uh, forty seventy four. Uh, but uh, the lower it goes, the more I'm buying. So, because I believe the merger will go through, and I believe that you will get rewarded, get your ninety four dollars and nineteen cents. Uh, easy money, especially in a market that is very very volatile right now. Anyways, that's it. That's it for the video. Thanks for watching, and I hope everyone has a great day. Bye.